الحمد لله وحده والصلاة والسلام على من لا نبي بعد السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته uh, This is uh, Human Kashabarzi, Executive Director and Founder of Khalil Center um, A Psychological and Spiritual uh, Wellness uh, Center Advancing the Practice of uh, Professional Psychology Rooted in Islamic Principles um, I wanted to extend out um, my support endorsement um, and positive feelings of the Initiative on Islam and Medicine. Um, I've known um, Dr. Asim Padella uh, over the years and it has been uh, a very pleasant and, um, and uh, honoring uh, relationship that I've had. Uh, I feel uh, very privileged to have come into contact with him and his work at the Initiative on Islam and Medicine. Over the years, we've done um, several collaborations together, um, but I know that as a center, like Khalil Center, um, that puts clinical services on the ground for addressing Muslim mental health, um, the importance of an initiative like uh, Dr. Asim Padella's, uh, the research um, that he provides is instrumental and critical uh, for clinicians like us, for centers like us, to be able to ensure that what we are doing is sound, um, is data-driven, is um, backed by um, uh, you know, the standards uh, that are found in academia, in clinical practice, uh, for healthcare and mental health care uh, delivery, uh, but also authentic to the Islamic tradition. And I think the strength that really he provides is this intersection of Islamic ethics and uh, healthcare practice. And he's doing this um, at a very in-depth um, uh, way, uh, in a way that's very scholarly, um, and in a collaborative way where he's been working alongside of uh, religious theologians and 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 and, and pr practitioners and providers um, and researchers and academics uh, to bring together um, all of the different uh, components of addressing very critical healthcare issues um, in a comprehensive way in a way that addresses and looks at the multifaceted um, or a very multifaceted approach that looks at all of the different aspects of addressing and providing tangible solutions. Um, we benefit from research, his research, we benefit uh, from his supervision and help that he provides in directing some of our research, and we benefit from some of the outcome of his research that we put into uh, application and practical usage in our centers. Uh, so I hope that the Initiative on Islam and Medicine will continue, will thrive, will continue to be an intellectual leader for the world, for Muslims globally, um, and in the um, and in North America. And I hope that um, we as a community will support this initiative because we have a, a responsibility to ensure that such talent does not go wasted and the um, amount of work and in-depth work and detailed uh, and detailed oriented work that's being put into such critical and important issues as Muslims um, are not wasted and don't go unnoticed in our communities. Um, thank you very much and I'm proud and honored to be, um, to be sending this video and endorsement um, and I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala benefits all of us. Barakallahu feekum. Assalamu alaikum.